Okay, I'm going to make this uh, quick, hopefully, um, regarding the... This is actually for people that are looking to buy the DJI Phantom and obviously wanting to put a camera underneath the, the Phantom itself. I'm looking to buy. Unfortunately, it seems to be a hot commodity right now, these DJI Phantoms, and none of the stores and hobby stores actually have any in stock. But anyway, I've been doing some research online and I've been trying to figure out a way to attach the Sony action cam underneath the DJI Phantom. Just like Apple, everything is geared towards GoPro. GoPro seems to be the camera of choice for DJI Phantom and trying to find brackets and mounts to fit this camera underneath has been a little bit challenging. As you can see, the action cam comes with a waterproof casing um, the only problem with this casing is that you've only got a tripod mount underneath and to attach that underneath the Phantom you're going to be shooting upside down and then you'd have to do some editing afterwards which isn't something that I really want to do. So I've been looking around and looking around and trying to figure out a way to do something uh, to attach the camera underneath. Obviously weight is an issue as well because you want the thing to fly. Uh, you don't want to you know, load the, the, the actual Phantom down itself. So I've been looking around and I was checking out online and let me just... I did see something online where a gentleman um, actually used a GoPro handlebar mount which I felt was actually... originally I felt was a, was a, a good choice. Um, The GoPro mount, as you can see, you've got the mount at the top which would fit directly onto the Phantom. And then the actual screws that come with the, this are a little short, so you'd have to go out and buy some extra length uh, screws to fit in there. Let me show you um, how you can attach the, the camera underneath this. Uh, you'd fit it up. Tighten them up a little bit. It's solid once it's there, you know. And then that would attach, sorry, that would attach underneath the cam, underneath the actual DJI. You can tilt it whatever way, obviously. That would work. And it's actually relatively light. It doesn't work with the uh, actual waterproof casing. Um, but I don't, I, I don't particularly think at this point, you know, you would need that. Um, however, that said, I did then go online and do some more research and I bought a few things on Amazon. And again, back and forward with uh, fellow DJI Phantom flyers, um, particularly looking at the Sony camera and how people were attaching this. Um, there's a new a new bracket mount that's just come out from Sony called the Sony Skeleton. Um, and this is what it looks like. It's just a case, flips open, and you can actually put the camera inside. Uh, okay, like so. Now this comes with some other attachments. So basically, you would fit this into here, like so. You can then place your camera inside, like so. And then you can mount it. As you can see, it's got the tripod mount at the top there. You can mount that directly uh, underneath the DJI Phantom. Now, you can buy another little, um, it's like a tripod mount bracket which can actually give you the options of how you want to, it's really built for this, to put on the side of a helmet where you can have it as a right angle or down below. I was thinking of attaching, you can attach this, like so, and then you can buy the GoPro little mount. Um, 
but there's just one other thing you'd have to buy and it's a male to male connector and then that would screw directly either you can screw it directly onto the actual base itself or this gives you some flexibility as well as angle of what you want to do this so different ways to mount basically you don't really need this because I think if you take this off you would then just use this part again you will need the male to male connection and then that can then just screw directly I don't have the piece yet but it's like a it's a small piece of it's a small GoPro that has this mount and then underneath it underneath the mount itself it has the female part I don't know if you can see that the female part so it would sit underneath and then that would then just you know if you can imagine the female part I'm hoping I'm explaining myself well but like I said I'm, I'm doing this because I've been finding it very difficult to find mounts to, you know, to mount my camera underneath the DJI Phantom. I think this one here is going to be the best option. And like I said, I mean, you can change that. And if you can imagine the camera there, hold, you can, you could then change the pivot of the actual camera itself up and down. Um, let me. Uh, I'm not sure right now, I'm going to do a weight, but I don't think this is that heavy at all. In fact, it's very, very light. So, like I said, this would probably be the best option um, with the least amount of weight that will make it work. Anyway, if you have any questions, feel free to drop me a line. Like I said, I, I have been, like others, I'm sure, I don't want to go to the expense of buying another $300, $400 camera right now. I think eventually I will probably try the GoPro, but for now I want to, you know, I think the biggest expense right now is get the camera and have some fun with it. Um, but it, like I said, it's a hot commodity right now and I can't get my hands on the DJI Phantom, so I'm, they're on order and hopefully I'll be flying soon. But I hope this helps for anybody that's got a Sony Action Cam and, uh, and hopefully this will work for you guys and this again this is for the Sony Action Cam HDR AS15 okay bye for now